I am Mukul Kumar Goel currently in third year pursuing my BTech in information technology here from Amity University Jaipur today i will give you the tour of labs here in the Amity University Jaipur we have two kinds of lab for the research and development one in D block and one in B block for D block we have science team labs for pharmacy microbiology bioinformatics and biotechnology i will give you the tour of B block labs which is for engineering department and later my colleague Gaurav will give you the tour of D block labs for science team students so let's go inside First lab in the ground floor is electrical machine lab especially for the electrical and mechanical students here they can have the exposure of pn junctions and electrical equipments for btech mechanical students we have manufacturing machines lab then we have beside it the workshop this workshop is used for btech mechanical students This is the computer lab like this we have eight computer labs in this building and these labs are used by all kinds of students in the campus Now we have come on the first floor of the B block building the first lab here is communication system lab in this lab we have satellite receiver and transmitter systems and the radar systems for receiving and transmitting analog signals This engineering mechanics lab is used by the students of engineering in first and second semester. This lab consists of jib screen, worm and worm wheel, simple wheel and along with the mechanical lab equipments. For EC and E engineering students we have microwave engineering lab. This is power supply for kale stove. These are microwave technologies equipments. This is the oscillator. C and E students need to study about analog electronics and for that we have analog electronics lab equipped with the diodes and the amplifier they need to study about waves and these equipments are equipped for the wave learning and the amplifier learning this is the project lab on the first floor for the ug final year students this lab helps them to create their final year projects equipped with the machineries and project of them developed by the students now we are in the measurement control lab for the ec and ee students in this lab we have step controller strain management force controller and the speed control machines this is the microprocessor systems and digital electronics and systems lab for the students of cse triple e and ec in this lab we study about digital electronics microprocessor systems major part of the curriculum for the first year students are physics and chemistry this is the physics lab for the first year students irrespective of their field Like physics chemistry is also the integral part of the curriculum for first year engineering students here students learn about the practical exposure of chemistry and chemicals this is the electrical machine lab used by the electrical engineering students here in the amity university this lab is equipped with a digital trainer motor trainer induction trainer and generator trainer machines used for the direct and alternative current Hi guys myself Gaurav and today I'll take you on a tour of research and development facilities available in our department of microbiology so this is the D block and it has uh, several schools like law schools communications communication school biotechnology school and institute of microbial technology currently we are on the ground floor and I'll take you inside the labs So this is the first lab on the ground floor and uh, it is sophisticated instrumentation lab and it is for the PhD students of the biotech and the life science students. This facility is maintained and managed by Dr. Kumar Sambhav sir and he'll brief you about the instruments here. So this is the facility and all the instrument is basically purchased from the DST Pulse program. This is the program from Government of India. GC MS MS system made by Thermo Fisher and this machine can be used for the pharmaceutical analysis purpose, pesticide analysis purpose. Pharmacognis lab and it is utilized by microbiology students.
This is a SPLC instrument which is used for the extraction of liquids from different solvents. These are the general purpose media which are used for the microbiological culture preparations and it is utilized by the microbiology students. This is the BOD incubator which is utilized by the microbiology students for the incubation of the microbiological plates. So this is the industrial microbiology lab which is used for uh, the instrumentation of industrial microbiological purposes. So this is a pilot scale uh, bioreactor fermenter which is used by used for the fermentation and production of different fermented foods. This is a horizontal autoclave which is used for the sterilization purposes. This is again a BOD incubator which is used for the uh, microbiological plates to be incubated. This is the minus 80 degree deep freezer by Thermo Scientific which is used for preservation of cell cultures. Now we are at Molecular Bacteriology Lab which has various in instrumentations such as RTP, CR machine, refrigerated centrifuge which are used for molecular biological purposes. This is a water bath which is used for various samples for sterilization purposes. Now we have the refrigerated centrifuge machine which is utilized for uh, molecular biological purposes. This is the RT-PCR machine. Now we are on the first floor of D block and it has labs and facilities for the pharma students. The first one is pharmacology lab. This year onwards, the Amity will have pharma department also. Thus, we are having the labs and facilities for the pharma students. Now we are on the second floor, and this floor houses Amity Institute of Biotechnology. So this is a central instrumentation facility which is utilized by microbiology, biotechnology, food tech, and pharma students, and it has instrumentation for various uh, microbiological and biotechnological purposes. So this is a deep freeze for the preservation of cell and cell cultures. This is a refrigerated centrifuge which has uh, uh, various applications in microbiology. This is a spectrophotometer which is used for uh, taking the optical density of microbes. Now this is a nanodose spectrophotometer which is used for the nano, uh, nanoparticle analysis. This is an orbital incubator shaker which is uh, used for the incubation of various cell samples and plant extracts. This is a biosafety cabinet which is used for the microbiological analysis of cell samples and cell cultures. So this is a molecular biology and RDT lab. So this is a BOD incubator which is used for the incubation of bacterial samples and cell plates. This is a vertical autoclave which is used for the sterilization purposes. This is a lyophilizer or also known as a freeze dryer which, is, which has applications in molecular biology and DNA. This is a PCR machine and it has applications in DNA and RNA analysis and chain propagation. So this is a food safety and quality control lab which is used, utilized by the food tech students and the microbiology students. This is a hot air oven used for the quality control purposes and, and used for sterilization purposes. So this was a tour of all the instrumentation and research facility here at Amity University Rajasthan. Hope you liked it. This is Gaurav Rawat signing off from the Amity University Rajasthan.